Pain from facet joint arthropathy, also called osteoarthritis, is a common condition and can affect people of all ages. As people age, osteoarthritis can become more prevalent, affecting different joints within the body, including the joints of the spine. Patients who lead more active lifestyles can feel the effects of osteoarthritis within facet joints or the connections between vertebrae in your spine that help to keep stability while bending and rotating. Osteoarthritis is a condition that destroys the smooth outer covering of the bone. The natural protective space between bones decreases, leading to grinding and the growth of osteophytes, also referred to as bone spurs. A medial branch nerve extends from each exiting nerve root of your spine and branches towards the facet joint and acts as the sensory nerve receptor for the facet joint. Pain signals associated with an arthritic facet joint are received by the medial branch nerve and transmitted to your brain in the form of discomfort. Your surgeon may decide to approach your surgery using a spine-specific endoscope. This technique is considered ultra-minimally invasive and is generally performed by either an orthopedic surgeon with fellowship training in spine or a neurosurgeon. Their goal is to address the pain caused by the arthritic facet joint by cutting the pain receptor pathway to your brain. The approach is done by creating a small incision, typically less than one centimeter, in a manner that minimizes soft tissue and muscle disruption. Through this incision, a cannula is placed to prepare for the spine endoscope. The endoscope provides real-time direct visualization of the surgical site to allow for increased precision during your procedure. Once your surgeon has reached the medial branch nerve, they will remove any surrounding tissue and then cut the nerve using a pair of micro scissors. The ends of the nerve and surrounding tissue are then cauterized using a special electrosurgery instrument to help decrease bleeding and minimize postoperative pain. At the conclusion of your surgery, a stitch or two might be used and a small bandage placed over each incision. Research has shown that endoscopic approaches to spine surgery achieve fewer postoperative complications and a reduced risk of infection, which can lead to a faster recovery, including a quicker return to normal activity.